Did you know that 1.3 billion people in the world live without electricity? The majority of these households use kerosene in a can for light. Not only is this outrageously dangerous, causing over a million deaths every year in fires, they also add 30 million cars worth of pollution into our atmosphere each year. A Denver-based company called Nocaro is determined to do something about it. I recently paid them a visit to find out how. So I've read someplace that one of the major challenges in a lot of these developing countries to literacy is kids simply don't have light to read by. Is that true? Yeah, that's why kids will travel one and a half, two hours a night to go to a place with light and study, and then they'll come back that night. We aren't focused on the very top of the economic pyramid where we're all living in a Western context, but we're focused on the base of the pyramid because there's such an enormous amount of people that are forgotten about. This is an example uh, of, a, of a kerosene lantern. This is what people use all over the world for light. And they literally, this is just, as you can see, it's made out of homemade cans and tins, and basically people fill these up with kerosene, put a little wick in there, and then they're burning fuel. It provides light at night, but it does so at a great burden on the environment and at a very serious and real impact on one's health and one's finances and one's safety. So just burning that in a small enclosed environment yeah. is for a little kid is like smoking 40 cigarettes a day. That's right. That's unbelievable. Yeah, it's terrible. It's terrible. So how are you guys solving this problem? Uh, so we have a variety of products, um, but the main one that, that's focused on lighting is this, which is our solar light bulb, and it's a fully integrated portable solar light. So you have a solar panel here, uh, open it up, you have a little AA nickel metal hydride rechargeable battery here. To break the cycle of poverty, we have to provide additional education opportunities for people. So they're in school during the day, they go home, they do some of their chores that they need to get done. If they're fortunate enough that their family could buy a little bit of kerosene they can study, but given a light, it can really change the outcome of that entire future trajectory of that family's wealth and welfare. It's a big thing. Give us an example of a place where a distributor is using your product to create entrepreneurs. A really good example is actually a group called Solar Sisters. They're in Uganda and they're a group of women entrepreneurs. And this is actually, Solar Sisters is actually a nonprofit organization that provides solar light products to these women called Solar Sisters who go out door to door in Uganda and also they're in one other country, I think Sri Lanka, and they sell these solar light products to people. So we're not just selling products, we're actually selling the ability for people to start, build, and run a business and help create jobs in their local economy.